Today, I am cutting my own hair. And not just in any old style. Today, I will be cutting my hair as a wolf cut. What is a wolf cut? Asked absolutely no one watching this video because everyone seems to know what a wolf cut is, thanks to TikTok. Uh, but if you don't have TikTok and you don't know, what a wolf cut is. A wolf cut is essentially a shag cut made popular by teenagers. I have seen this video here pop up a couple of times lately. How to cut a wolf cut in five minutes. TikTok haircut trend, wolf cut tutorial. <laughs> Mr. Paul Watts hair here is uh, going to teach me. <laughs> now, I haven't actually watched this video. I've just seen it popping up and I thought, you know what? Why don't I just turn on the camera and record the chaos. So you guys can tune in with me as I watch this video and as I cut my own hair. Why have I decided to spontaneously ruin my hair even further? Well, my husband just left the house for the first time since June. Uh, he's gone out and I have the house to myself. And what better time to make terrible mistakes <laughs> and do something that a voice of reason would otherwise talk me out of doing. Also. I like surprises. He likes surprises. If this turns out well, he'll be pleasantly surprised. And if it doesn't turn out well, it gives the opportunity for more content. I can just see it now. My husband fixes the haircut that I ruined. Now, for anyone that's new here, you're probably wondering what is going on with her hair and why does it look like straw? It's been a, a long and difficult two years for my poor head of hair. I'll put a little bit of a playlist down below so you can watch my hair go from this to this slowly, as I slowly spiralled into insanity and lost my mind. But the reason that it is the way that it is right now is because I've been washing this part of my head with Function of Beauty Colour Lasting Shampoo, and I've been washing this side of my head with Head and Shoulders. I wanted to see just how quickly the colour would wash out, and it has made quite a difference using the Colour Stay Shampoo. This side has not really changed much in about the past eight washes. It's just been just like this and has hardly changed. So I'm thinking once I've cut my hair into the wolf cut, I will then re-dye my hair, probably half purple, half pink, but that's not going to happen today. You're going to have to subscribe and turn on notifications to see that. What, what was that? Ghosts. The ghosts don't like that I've been torturing my hair. They, they tend to make banging sounds in the walls to try and stop me, but you can't stop me! You can't. No one can stop me. So, now that you understand the situation that we're in, let's hit play on this video and see what we gotta do to look like this, because that that's, that's what I wanna look like. I didn't know what a wolf cut was, and I asked my subscribers, what should I do to my hair next? And most of them sent me that picture and they said, do this, do it now. So, Mr. Paul, what do I have to do to look like that? And it's come right back around and a lot of people are doing it on TikTok right now that they're basically just doing one ponytail like Lee did, brought it all the way to the front. But I'm doing two because I want there to be a lot more texture through the back, which is why I've done two ponytails. Wait. So let's make a start with his hair. Oh going. God. What we want to do. Wait, 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 slow down. Sorry, sir. You're moving it. too fast. I have to do what? It looks like there's a line from the mannequin's ears going up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> am I actually gonna do this? Am I actually doing this right now? All right, how am I gonna get such a clean line? Look how clean and crisp the line is on the mannequin's ear. It's like a dead straight line coming up. Oh God, how am I gonna do? This was a terrible idea. I'm already regretting everything. Alex encounters one slight inconvenience and wants to completely give up. I can't tell if I've made a nice line. Is there a nice line? I can't help but feel like Mr. Paul lied. He said five minute wolf cut. It's taken me eight minutes to separate my hair. If you even dare leave a comment about my regrowth. There's a reason my regrowth is like this. Uh, Google it. I'm sick of explaining it. Just Google Australian news. All right, the first bit is tied up. And it looks as though the second part, he's tied it actually very high up here. I'm glad that I looked so closely because I was just about to wrap the hair tie like this. But that looks like he's sort of managed to get the hair right up. All right, I'm ready for a motion. So I'm going to take off to the forehead is what I'm going to be working to. And to basically all we're going to do is just chop, taking all this hair off. Okay. All right, I have here a pair of scissors. These are dog grooming scissors. Why? Because apparently I look like a mutt. So, fitting. 
And basically, all we're going to do is just chop into there, taking all this hair off. I have not drunk enough wine for this today. Oh my God, okay, I'm gonna do it. Okay. And I'm just point cutting in, just to take all this hair out, still adding texture to the hair. And we come over here. And then we're just gonna clean up anything. Let's just brush it. And I'm just gonna hold it back from here. Wash the cat. And add. Treat yourself. Now is not a good time for an ad. I wanna make sure we've got a nice straight line as well. So a nice straight line. In. And what I mean by sort of like a makeup brush, shaver brush, like that. And there we go. That is to the forehead. <gasps> Still maintaining length, but taking away some of the weight. There we go, it's just like a cool little fringe at the minute. A cool little fringe? Is it really? Looks more like a big f mistake to me, my friend. The kinks in my hair are making this a little bit awkward. I feel like this part here probably needs a little bit taken away. You know what, why don't we just leave it here? Nothing beats a good cliffhanger. Why don't we just uh, end the video here? <laughs> you guys don't need to know what this looks like when I take it out of the hair tie. Look at this. <sighs> now, with the ponytail, we're gonna bring it up, and we want this to be like a shaving brush as well. So we're going to bring this up to there. To where? And then ha we're just going to where? deep point cut. Hang on. How far up is that? All the way across there. Hang on. How am I supposed to do that at the back of my own head? Straight up to the ceiling. Straight up to the ceiling. All right. Let's go straight up to the ceiling. All right. This is it. I'm a little bit hesitant to go as low as he did. It looked as though he was kind of cutting it around here, but I, I might just give it a little bit more length. Like I might try more this sort of height because I don't know what I'm doing and I don't want to lose all of my hair. If I go crying to a real hairdresser, uh, help me, I've ruined my hair. I want there to be something left for them to work with. So let's do probably around here, I'm gonna say. All right, point cut. Oh my God. should not be doing this on my own. It's not cutting. Oh, my arms are getting tired. Ugh. I swear to God, hairdressing is a form of exercise, is it not? How does one, ow, I almost cut my finger. Well, it turns out I did cut myself, whoops. Oh, see, now I'm angry. Now I'm just cutting out of rage. Oh, my arms are burning. <laughs> they're, uh, they're burning. Oh my God, I feel like I'm doing a workout. I'm not even cutting, I'm just missing. Far out. Oh, my arms. Oh, I need a break. You know what? I'm just gonna leave it like that because my arms they hurt too much. They've turned to jelly. I'm a pathetic human. All right, now what? All right, okay. Comes out like that. Okay. So there's the back. Look at that. Um, Look at those layers. Look at that. All that texture, so cool. So cool. Is it? Is it cool? I can't see. All oh, the front. Okay. You ready? Let's give her a shake. Oh, let's give her a shake. Oh my god, do I look like that? Do I look like that? Wait, hang on. Do I look like that? I'm not wearing my glasses and I can't see in the viewfinder and I can't see. What do I. Now, if that's not cool, I don't know what is. Is it cool? 
I need to turn around and look in the mirror. Oh. Wait. Wait. Maybe if I brush it. Maybe. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's so short. Oh f You know what? It, it doesn't look too bad at the back for something that was so quick it, it definitely doesn't look too bad I, I kind of feel like these little bits that I've got here they could be a little bit shorter just to really add a bit more to the layering so maybe I should try to cut it a little bit you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna turn the camera off uh, because I, I can't talk and concentrate it's physically impossible I'm gonna turn the camera off have a little tiny bit of a snip at my fringe and try to maybe tidy it up a little bit and then I'm gonna put on some makeup and do like a proper reveal. <laughs> well, I, I've done it. I've cut my own fringe, made it a bit shorter. I tried to tidy it up a little bit and this is what I look like. <laughs> I'm really happy. Oh my God. So you know what? For something I just did myself in quite literally not five minutes, probably 12. <laughs> Okay, I'm sad that I didn't leave these bits to be a little bit longer. I know that if I straighten my hair that this will be longer. Uh, I've also kind of stuffed up a little bit in terms of this side is a fair bit thicker than this side. This side is very thin as you can see, but also I have been using head and shoulders on this side uh, and my hair is not great over here. Uh, this side is a little bit more plump and luscious because I've been using better products but also there is just more hair on this side. I did briefly attempt to thin it out and things started going terribly wrong so I thought no no I I'm just going to leave it for now and hopefully I can find a professional that could tidy this up for me and make it look the way that it's supposed to look. It's close, it's close and I feel like if it were executed properly this would be a good hairstyle for me. I actually, I really like it. I've put on like a little tank because this, I don't know, there's something about the muscle tees and this haircut that just feel like they go together well. And uh, I, I'm really, 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 really happy. Tell me what you guys think in the comments down below. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Uh, if I've ruined my hair, press the like button. Thank you. Now, Dan's just texted me and said he's going to be home in an hour. And you know what that means? An hour gives me enough time to dye my hair. So I'm going to grab some products uh, and I'm going to do purple on this side and pink on this side. And I'm going to look very, very different when Daniel gets home. I'm going to sit myself in our bedroom. I'm going to let him come upstairs. He's going to open the door, not knowing at all what's just happened. And he's going to be very shocked. So if you want to see that and you want to see me dyeing my hair half pink, half purple, please subscribe and turn on notifications so you know when I upload that video. Uh, spoiler alert, it's going to be tomorrow. Yeah, like a full 24 hours after this one gets uploaded that one will be uploaded. So you don't have to wait too long. So come back tomorrow. Let me just quickly grab the products that I'm gonna be dyeing my hair with. All right, so the colors I'm gonna be using to dye my hair are two-tone treatment hair color in the shade Pastel Violet by Etude House and Turn Up Color Treatment in Pink by April Skin. Now I got these off Yes Style and uh, I'm gonna start that now. And if you wanna see how all of that turns out, come back tomorrow. But for now, that's it. That's everything. I hope that you like this video. I hope that you aren't too mad that I've continued to ruin my hair. But I have vowed that for every comment that says, you've ruined your hair, it looks gross, I'm going to do something even worse. So feel free to leave the hate below. It just gives me reason to go green. And with that, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Mwah!
Oh, maybe that's what I should do next. Maybe I should just buzz all of that off. Pull a Natalie Dormer in Hunger Games. 